Central Red Raiders, Jason Chilton. Jason Chilton is senior and uh, center. And uh, first of all, Jason, congratulations on uh, Division One Most Valuable Player. Thanks. Uh, thanks a lot. As a you get an honor to receive as a Division One MVP. You were saying a little bit a little while ago that uh, at Chill Arena you were kind of surprised. Yeah, I was surprised. I went up to the the box there to see if uh, I any of our players made the section team all northern and uh, I looked on the list and my name was first there and it said MVP and I was like wow I didn't expect to receive an award like that let me uh before the season started I talked to coach Timmy Long and uh he said this about you you tell me if uh, how accurate coach was okay six foot 170 uh alternate captain good playmaker good shot rough we'll see the penalty box every once in a while and uh, my first line center. Yeah. Is, he, is he accurate? Yeah, he's accurate on that. I do see the box once in a while. I get, I like to set up plays, and I get, well, as you know, as you know, I get quite a few penalties. <laughs> You're a share of them, huh? Yeah. Let's talk a little bit about last season. Uh, you were with the Red Raiders, who who lost in a sectional championship game, but then got an at large bid. Mm -hmm. um, you won the state regional by. Uh, by beating Oswego 7-1. Then you went on and you won in the semifinals, 8-1 over Aquinas, I believe. And then you lost in the finals 4-3 to Suffer. So uh, you're familiar with the with state play. and uh, Do you see any difference? Uh, uh, how are you looking at this season? Are you more hungrier than last year? Oh, well, last season we had a little bit more depth on defense. We uh, had uh, three solid lines like we do this year. Well, that'll be our key is the three solid lines. Well, our defense is not as strong. We have Chris Aldis back there. He's Aldis and Smith who are a big key in our defense. So we'll go into the Oswego game with our heads up, four checking hard, trying to get the puck in the net, quick, a few quick goals off the start to bring down the other team. Let's talk a little bit about your season this this year, uh, playing with the line mates uh, Derek Gladding and uh, Josh Vanberg. Yeah, Gladding, he's a real asset to our line. He likes to set up plays, feed Spamber, who breaks in on the right wing all the time and gets that shot on top corner, and he usually gets it when he takes that shot. Now, Coach Long separated you two guys, uh, or your line, I should say, uh, uh, throughout the season at times just to shake shake things up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, he wanted to get the, see if we could send it, uh, make up with another line, make, get a few key lines going, see if uh, how the other lines work. Now, Jason Chilton not only was named the most valuable player this year in Division One, but uh, you were also selected to Team New York and uh, uh, to high school select team. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, um, we had uh, about 10 players from the scene go down and all this, and uh, Cameron also made the team, and Jason Simpson made alternate as a goaltender. But it's a tournament that goes to Chicago. To, we compete with uh, 23 other states, and... It's a exposure for the players, for scouts to look at them, and it's a great honor to play in that ter that tournament. Does Jason Chilton have uh, aspirations of going on after uh, you know after high school season's over? Yeah, I've applied to a few prep schools, and we'll see how Chicago how it goes in the Chicago. And we'll see if I uh, get any offers or anything from the scouts. From the there. scouts, and I'm there. Let's talk about uh, Oswego a little bit. You guys played them earlier in the season. Winners uh, five three. But it was a pretty good hockey game. Yeah, it was a real good hockey game. They got a first line uh, kid by the name of Bauer and Siapa, and a defenseman that's Masters. They're their two, their key players, and we'll be uh, keen on them, and they'll probably be keen on Cameron's line and my line. Let's talk a little bit about that Cameron line. Uh, Trevor Cameron and Mark Tayo, Josh Spanberg. Boy, those guys had a great year. Yeah, uh, Cameron and uh, the Bombard and Tayo. They've had a uh, Real great year. Tyle, he has an excellent shot. The Bombard's always hustling. He's always buzzing out there. And Cameron, he just powers over everybody and gets that shot off in front of the net. And then the third line this year, if you want to call it the third line, Matt Reed, Sebastian Bergeron, Brian Terry. Yeah, Brian Terry, he likes to go in the corners, get rough. Reed, he's only a freshman, but he'll he'll be going along. He's got good moves. He moves around well. And uh, Bergeron, he's always there to get the quick shot into that. Back on defense this season, uh, Jason, uh, guys like uh, Chris Aldis. Chris Aldis had a great season. Yeah, he's had an outstanding season. He's been our 
him and Smith been our powerhouse on this point. Mike and Abinett was hurt a little while this Mike season. Mike and Abinett, he's only a junior. He's he's had a few a little bit of playing time. He's he'll be out there. Derek DeRocher. DeRocher, he's he's out well. Frankie Joy, he's only a sophomore. He's done well out there too. Goaltending early in the season. <laughs> Uh, Mike Ramsdale and Jason Simpson and Brian Garsher each each saw their share of time. Yeah, Ramsdale, he's our top goaltender. He's been playing excellent in the last few games, really coming on. Garsha, he's been hanging in there. He's done all right. Simpson, he's played well. He played against Oswego last time, had a excellent game. They only scored two power play goals on him. So the big game uh, this weekend with Oswego, and uh, what what do you feel are the keys? I feel that we'll have to have tough D. And uh, first two lines will have to shine, get the goals in the net. Jason, thanks so much for your time, and uh, very best of luck this weekend and on the road to Utica. Thanks a lot. My guest has been Jason Chilton, number 16 for the Messina Central Red Raiders. And when we return, we'll recap that first period of play. You're watching Messina Central Red Raiders Hockey here on Edwards Production Sports. <laughs> 